how have you all been? We are going to be talking about the Holy Spirit today. Jesus came into and bestowed on the disciples the Holy Spirit, and it appeared like tongues of flame. And this is the Holy Spirit. You know, and it's like, here's the fire, and a kind of a tongue of flame coming up here, a tongue of flame coming up here. And it was kind of over them, somehow. It was descended on them. But what is this Holy Spirit? Because at your baptism, you received the Holy Spirit, and you were made children of God. So the Holy Spirit is this power that's put into you and it opens your eyes and your minds and your hearts to be like Jesus, to be kind and to serve others, to take care of them and be concerned about them, to feel their hurts when they have hurts and to feel their happiness when they have joy and just to understand and be with them. The Holy Spirit gives you that ability to do that. And sometimes it's really hard, especially when your brother or sister is angry with you and you want to defend yourself and say, it wasn't my fault. But you've got to listen to their perspective. And you go, you know, I didn't want to hurt you. I didn't mean to do that. That wasn't what I was trying to do. And you talk with your brother or your sister and you become very close. The Holy Spirit gives you the power to be calm and to be able to have that conversation. It gives you the power to not be afraid to go do things for others. Even when you've never done it before but you've seen your mom and daddy doing these things, you know, helping others, maybe pulling the weeds in the garden. And so you can go out and help and do these things and you'll get better and better at it. The Holy Spirit just keeps making you stronger and stronger. It's never done working in you. So this week, let's go out there and recognize and understand that we are empowered specially See how God is working in your lives. Let's pray. Gracious Lord, you are in us and sometimes we forget. We don't pay attention. Help us to see you, to feel you, and to live like you want us to live. Loving others, helping others through their troubles, and being helpers with our families and our neighbors. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.